Good morning, this is David from Sprigio calling in, and today we have two fantastic people with us. We have Tiara and Kelsey, and we are going to be talking about their fantastic experience about creating a video that goes against bullying and the experiences that they've had within their schools, what the next videos are going to be. So anyways, if you could please introduce yourselves, and we'll get straight into it. I'm Kelsey, and this is Tiara, and we're both seniors at Delphi, and yeah. <laughs> Fantastic. All right, so could you tell me a little bit about the uh, video story and basically how it started before you actually created that video? Um, what inspired you to do so? Well, at, you know, the first um, Gay Straight Alliance meeting of our school year, because I'm one of the student leaders of it, I went on alloutworks because I've been like receiving emails from them for a few years about, like, signing petitions, like, and, like, anti-gay, like, campaigns, and I saw a video, and I was like, all right, well, this is what it's about, and I played it, and then after the meeting, Tiara was like, we, we, we should make a video like that. Yeah. Let's do it. Because, <laughs> um, I was listening to, like, other students, and the, how they felt with the All Out Dot Org video, and they were, like, this is amazing, speechless, and I was like, <laughs> it's a great idea, and honestly, it's amazing what happens when you go out of your way to actually create something. Only great things happen because of that. All right, so then could you tell us, uh, viewers a little bit about your video? I'm sure that they're going to be able to see it on their own time, but... All right, well, um, the video is about <laughs> high school standing up and going out all out for bullying. Um, in the video, there are... Student, there's students and their teachers in Delcy who show statistics about bullying and suicide and, um... I know, like, this is one statistic that's, like, like, 9% of students at our school say that bullying is, like, a real statistic. We got that from a bullying survey from last year, and then we got it, the results this year. And then, like, all the kids that we pushed out the pictures with, they're, like, they're real kids that have killed themselves and, like, the past year and a half. Yeah. yeah. And um, they're all in, like, our um, age group in high school, so it's, like, 15 to... I think we were even just, like, 13 to Yeah, it's, like, 13 to 19, yeah. so it kind of like, impacts us because it's, like, wow, mm -hmm. these people actually... Like, kids our age are yeah. doing this. And just, like, it helped... We wanted to open, like, people's eyes. Yeah, absolutely. So, and definitely took the right path, so... What has been the experience thus far? So you created the video and you posted it up on YouTube, I'd imagine, at first. Um, what was the impact that it had on people at your school? I know yeah. teachers and students would come up to me and like, that was amazing. Yeah. Like, a teacher actually said she started tearing up. Because yeah, so many people told us that like, they started yeah. crying and they're like, I can't believe like this is real and like about the kids like in the video they were like did they really kill themselves and we were like yeah they did and they were like their looks on their faces were just like oh my god and I think because you saw the pictures of the students and their age mm -hmm. it really was like wow like these are actually yeah. people I think really seeing like the age too helped yeah. a lot because I know a lot of people were like that kid was only 13 and I was like yeah <laughs> this is happening this is real yeah, it creates that personal connection between the viewer and you know what actually happened and really hits hard in regards to how bullying really does affect people and how it could end in these awful situations. So I'm really happy that you guys reached out to it. Um, can you tell me a little bit about how it impacted yourselves? So from the point where you decided to say, yeah, absolutely, I'm going to create this video, uh, to the point where you're getting all this feedback from people saying, wow, this is amazing, thank you so much. I know for like I think both of us like we've been we've been bullied before like incessantly yeah. so like when we saw the video we were like you know what let's see this like because I know personally like when I ask the other people like oh bullying's not a big deal it's like no it actually yeah. really is like even at our school and so we wanted to make the video to like show it and then just after we were like yeah we just we made this difference and like I know, just yeah I know when I was researching I did people who commit suicide especially. I was getting really emotional because it just, it made me upset that these people felt this way and I could do anything to help yeah. them because I didn't know them. So it scared me, like, there might be someone in my school 
that feels this way, and I just don't yeah. know. Yeah, and if we, like, made the video maybe they'd see it and be yeah. like, oh, I can go to them. Like, it's okay. I'm not alone in this. Yeah, absolutely. And, you know, it's it really is a sad statistic, so to speak, that the majority of people that get bullied, they don't do anything about it. They keep it to themselves, and it ends up, you know, in the worst-case scenario, that they do end up committing suicide, and the majority of the time, they don't tell anyone. They're afraid to tell their parents, afraid to tell their teachers. So it really does create this problem, and um, just as a quick thing about Sprigia is that that's exactly what we set out to prevent from happening. It powers kids with a voice so that they could actually go on report and know that, first of all, we care about them, and second of all, the problem is going to be taken care of. So that that really is a huge thing, but <clears throat> it really starts with a proactive stance. So people like yourself, which is absolutely amazing, and thank you so much for this great thing that you have done. <laughs> Happy to see those smiles. Um, it, it really starts at that point in time where people take that initiative in their own hands because everyone thinks that, well, you know, it's going to pass or I'm going to grow up and bullying is going to stop. It doesn't really stop. It just takes different forms. And at that point in time where people decide to take things into their own hands, <clears throat> excuse me, and to report it to uh, administrators or, you know, stand up for themselves, stand up for other people, that is when that culture really changes. And when that culture changes, then bullying changes completely. And it can be removed from the school, at least for the most part. So, anyways, in regards to that, enough of my ranting on, um, what would you say, how would you recommend for students to take action against bullying within their schools, whether it be creating videos or whatever else? I think it honestly just starts with, like, standing up and being like, this is my position on it, and not just being like, oh, well, they said it, so I'll, instead of, like, saying anything, I'll just sit here and kind of just twiddle my thumbs about it, like, yeah. really just being going up to, like, someone and being like, it's okay, I am I can be here for you, yeah. like, or standing up for the person and being bullied, saying, this isn't, like, this is okay that, like, you're feeling this way, yeah. and, like, I'm here to help you. Mm -hmm. I think that's one of the reasons why I wanted students and teachers involved, because you can see that, like, oh, these people are here for me, and they're going to they yeah. help me no matter what, and, yeah, like a lot of people think they need to do this big, like, life-changing thing, when yeah. in reality, you just walk up to someone and be like, are you okay? Like, do you want to go sit sit with us? Like, just hang out and talk to them. Yeah, it really doesn't take that big of an action. All it does is to walk over and offer, say that, you know, I'm here for you, or if you see something in the process of happening, then you just walk over. And sometimes all it takes is for you to walk over. You don't have to say anything, just look at them. Yeah, let's go. Don't worry about it. Yeah, just like, <laughs> Yeah. So, what is the next video going to be about? Well, I know we want to make videos that, like, about issues that, like, teens can relate to and that they should be able to take stances on. Yeah, like, body, like, self-image. Yeah. And, like, depression. Yeah. Like, stress, how to deal with it. Yeah, certain things that, like, every teenager goes through, so they know they're not, <clears throat> Yeah, it's absolutely awesome. So I look forward to seeing this uh, pretty soon, and hopefully we'll be able to have you back on when you're going to be huge and famous. <laughs> um, all right, so with that, are there any last things that you'd like to tell our viewers? Uh, any words of inspiration, words of wisdom, or just something simple? Just not to be corny, but if you are feeling, like, depressed and, like, you can't do it, you can do it. And, like, I know... If, if there's any, like, me and Tia are here for you, even, yeah. like, though you don't personally know us, like, you don't see us in public, like, we, are here for we you. still love you. Yeah. And there's yeah. two people that you didn't have before that you love you so much. Yeah. There's always someone there. You're never alone. So, you know, always go and ask someone, either it's, you know, your guidance counselor, your principal, or just someone that you can trust. If you can't trust anyone, just, like, yeah. You can still go to, like, you know, like, the um, operations, like, there's, like, there's, like, there's a lot of things, like, online, you can, like, search, and 
I was like hoping that this video could mm -hmm. really help people. Yeah. And just um, because we want everyone to know that they are important mm -hmm. and that they do mean something. If not, if they don't think to anyone else, we want them to know that they do mean something to us. Yeah. No, I can promise you that there's a lot more people than yourselves. Absolutely fantastic, and, you know, we all very much care for them, and there really is a community of support for everyone anywhere, which is absolutely awesome. All right, well, anyways, it was a pleasure talking to the both of you, and uh, thank you so much. I look forward to having you back on soon. Thank you.